I was saying welcome back to my channel. I basically was going through depression, anxiety, and stress um, throughout this pregnancy, but a lot is going on inside of my head. So my um, my volume on my phone keeps going up and down. So I just basically gonna tell you what I was saying in the video. When you go through a lot mentally in your head, people don't understand what you're going through. But TikTok took down one of my recent videos that I put up of Lena saying minor safety, but you got babies on the app that post videos every day. And that's just like, what is minor safety when I sh I'm holding my baby on my lap is what I'm trying to say. I don't see what's wrong with holding your child while she's sick and doing a video. People are just so miserable, like literally. And you know, I don't think about it like that. I just look at it like, you know, I go out here and show my life. I show my contents out here and let the world see what I got going on with my beautiful children. But a lot of people just can't relate to that. But anyways, the last couple of days I was going through what I was going through, dealing with my tooth getting pulled out, my headaches, my kids, my pregnancy. So, you know, I think I need a little break, but I decided to get up here and talk to y'all. Let y'all know I'm not going to do the baby reveal on my uh, TikTok. Cause they might get that banned as well that I'm just going to do it on my uh, on my YouTube or my Instagram. And I'm in here now talking to Isaiah. He's taking my dirty clothes and throwing it everywhere. So he decided to give me a hug, telling me he loved me like he always do. But anyways, y'all, sometimes it's just like in life, you have to let certain things go out of your life to breathe, especially social media, because they'll have your mind fucked up. Psycho bully is a bad thing for a lot of people, internet bully or whatever y'all call that thing. And I have zero tolerance for that. But anyways, I was in here talking on the video, and all of a sudden my phone had cut off, and I was there picking up my clothes, throwing them all over the floor. Thought it was a ghost here for a minute. Because I was just standing recording and looking around and talking to Isaiah and talking to y'all about my life. And here we go, my phone shut down. But anyways, y'all can come over to my YouTube channel and sit and watch uh, the baby reveal party. What I was saying on this part was my grandma came to me last night and I was telling her that I was tired and I missed her. And I wanted to come back home. And I woke up out of the dream. Like, boy, is she here? But I had a lot going on. I had to start trying to keep me swimming and tell me to hold this shit down with my kids. But, you know, people don't understand. Dreams is dreams, but sometimes dreams is real. Like, my grandma has been gone for 16 years. And I still, not a day, think about the days we went out and had ice cream. And we cook in the kitchen and we do things together. But a lot of things my kids don't understand and know about their mothers that I'm built different. Like, I'm built strong, but I'm also built as a, a woman who has been through so much as a child in my childhood life that I didn't have a mother, that I had a grandmother. And the definition of a real mother is my grandmother because she raised me to be who I am today to take care of my children. I just want to share my journey with everybody else and let them see what I went through. You know what I'm saying? That's why I show so much of motherlyhood on my contents on TikTok, Instagram and YouTube. YouTube. So y'all enjoy the video. I deal with a lot on a daily and I know as mothers we all do. What I was saying was if babies on TikTok doing dance and doing stuff, do people report videos that people have blue check marks by their name and they put the videos back up as well? Anyways, I'm not making a big deal out of nothing. I'm just saying. Stop reporting my videos. Stop coming onto my account if you don't like what you see, if you don't like my kids and report my videos. At the end of the day, I get up here and try to show everything on the platform. Everybody see what I got going on. But on my YouTube channel, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got time for the drama. I ain't got time for nobody to try to do what I got to do to live. My kid's father, everybody asks about him. Is that a third? Oh, my God. Yeah, like I'm a celebrity when I'm not.
What I was saying was I was doing a video talking and all of a sudden my phone got tapped in like somebody was playing on the screen. Like, I don't know. It was crazy. Like somebody was tapping in like a ghost in it or something. I don't know what was going on, but I think somebody trying to tap into my phone. Eat any day. So that's mine to say the two, so that's crazy. Come on. Now I don't want to be aggravated. That's all. See? Hey. Where your other sock? Um, your butt state? You boo boo? You ready to get changed? Yeah. Alright, what did you change? We gotta find your socks. Alright, yeah, we're gonna I'm gonna get off this thing. I just came up here and talked to y'all, see how y'all was doing, see what's going on. Let y'all know TikTok is just nothing but full of drama you got miserable uh, irritated ass people that's on that app that just don't care about nothing but they sales and don't want to see you have nothing but if you on tiktok and you really like doing what you do what do you want what you want what about your socks continue on doing what you do on tiktok forget the haters like i said baby reveal will be on my youtube channel i'm gonna do a video or on my instagram and i'll see you guys there don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Which you don't have to like the video. You don't have to comment or you don't have to subscribe. It's up to you. But I'm going to try to come with more videos soon. huh? I'll get this on the table, brother. I'll get it. See you guys later. Peace. I'll get it.